Right now at 4.30, this is going to impact a lot of drivers this morning. Yeah, take a look at this. A major crash here. It shut down South Tryon in Steel Creek. Look at this. This involves a tractor trailer. There it is. Also a pickup truck, and there's debris everywhere. That includes a traffic light on the ground. Eyewitness News reporter Gina Esposito is uh, live for us. And Gina, this is a really busy part of town. Yeah, this will impact people's drives. So they're traveling on outbound Tryon this morning. I want to walk you through the scene. This is the, you can see the truck involved in this crash, severely damaged, missing a tire in the back. Crews just pulled this truck away from this wall right here. This is the AAA business. Um, this truck crashed with a tractor trailer that's just behind it, um, very damaged as well. Police tell us that how this happened is that the tractor trailer was heading south on southbound Tryon, and this white pickup truck was was trying to turn onto Steelcroft, which is the road we're standing on right now. And at some point, that tractor trailer hit this truck, and both of them crashed right here. Uh, we're told that three people did go to the hospital, including the driver of this white pickup truck, and two people were the, in the tractor trailer. So we're checking to see on their condition here. But again, this is going to impact a lot of people because we do have outbound uh, Tryon closed right here. And you can see there's a lot of glass on the road because it's did cause some damage to some traffic signals here. So we know that the city is going to be out here this morning. Duke Energy, they're already out here. So let's head over to Track T9's Mark Taylor for a look at how to get around all of this. It's the outbound side that's uh, completely blocked. Inbound is open, but you'll notice the flashing lights in that stretch. So either way, you're going to take it slow. So it happened at Steelcroft Parkway south of Steel Creek, heading outbound. You can still access 160, take Hamilton over to Youngblood, back towards 49, or take Steel Creek to Sledge, Shopton Road West, back towards South Trine, you'll get around that closure.